Hey, how the hell did you get out here? I don't know either. We're live on the World Wide Web here, and I really think it's time that we found ourselves a nice little comfortable chair and a freaking hot drink. Get yourself a frappuccino or a cappuccino or an autumnal evening beverage of some sort or another and join us here for some country music in the woods. Uh, we got a fire, we got candles, we got guitars, and uh, we might even have friends. And uh, at, as time passes, perhaps we'll all get to know a little bit about each other. And the first thing you should know is I'm a big old country goth at heart. I think little little goth on the prairie might be my true soul's colors. And so I got to light up these little tokens of my gratitude to flame fire and all things uh, dark, mysterious, and autumnal. So shoot. Let's do the purpose of our errand. I'm going to play a song for you. Uh, this is a new one. It's going to be on a record that's not out yet anywhere, um, but soon you will get to hear noises that sound like this one. Here we go. Ooh, listen to that sucker crackle. turn at the break of day I'd leave a leg just to get away You call it splendor, I call it pain I'm limping back to the land of rain I'll rise when the rooster crows Rise when the rooster crows I'm going back south where the sun shines hot Oh, down where the river cane grows We'll probably hear some songs about travel and going out in the world tonight and oh shoot and there's somebody that might be singing one. what's up willie well good evening nick you uh you drive here you know fancy that i did i pulled my rig up just behind your beautiful little camper there i didn't hear it it must be a hybrid well uh this song's about traveling so let's uh or this 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 verse here it's about uh you know the idea of like being homesick even when you're home i love that one well, well, well. this is this is the feeling if you go west, don't go for long. You'll sing out homesick country songs. Trees ne'er my kind of riches. I'll do my best just to keep between the ditches. I'll rise when the rooster crows. Rise when the rooster crows. I'm going back south where the sun shines hot. Oh, down where the river cane grows. So I, I heard a tale about this original song because it's based off an old string band recording and I guess Rising at the Rooster Crow is early for some people. It's not early for me, but this song's about kind of like being lazy, I think, and not working for the man. Hey, speaking of working for the man and being lazy, that's my fucking, that's my other dope smoker at dawn, Mr. Dylan Earl himself. How you doing? Do you drive here too? Oh, buddy, I flew, I flew all the way out here. Oh. Well, it must um, be that altitude. It's that altitude. It's that altitude. It's up here. By candlelight we roam. Okay, well, last song, uh, verse of the song, I reckon. Here we go. When Gabriel comes to blow his horn, will the scarlet banner at last be torn? Prepare yourself and try to get away. You can't eat money and buy your fate. I'll rise when the rooster crows. Rise when the rooster crows. I'm going back south where the sun shines hot. Oh, down where the river came. Rise when the rooster crows, rise when the rooster crows, I'm going back south where the sun shines hot, oh, down where the river cane grows. You know, if you take a piece of river cane, cut it on both ends and leave those like little segments intact and throw it in the fire, it sounds like a firecracker, eventually. Dramatic. Songs for the heart. I'll be damned. 
Well, uh, cool. Does somebody else want to do this whole uh, thing? Yeah. Carlisle, I think. Yes, yes, yes. Bring it to us. Thank you, Dr. Shoulders. Uh, it's always a pleasure to hear anything that Nick is singing um, on account of, uh, well, for so many different reasons. Not only the high lonesome tone, but also the, uh, the, the pleasingly uh, anti-fascist interludes. Um, I hope that you guys are all uh, not afraid to put a little whiskers in your, uh, in your LaCroix tonight. That's what we're doing out here. Um, and as promised, uh, I'm going to rip off another little joint about uh, traveling around these United States, Canada and Mexico, and all other places that have no borders, um, mental and otherwise. Uh, I want to dedicate this song briefly to uh, every last person that's had to live between four wheels instead of between four walls. Everybody who's been down and out and upside down and lost everything they had and a portion of their furniture. Um, uh, if, it ain't je ne sais quoi, uh, if it ain't je ne sais quoi, I don't know what it is. It's the uh, van life. Let's hit it. Friends, I quit my job making minimum wage. I look fairly well twice and act half my age. I'm looking for somewhere that can handle the rage of this young man on the run. Now with rarely paid taxes and shitty insurance, a glove box full of summons and warrants, a finely tuned wish things were that weren't, you could say I was looking for fun. So I bought an old one red Dodge Ram, bought two pints of whiskey and a 30 of hams. Now I'm peeing in bottles and eating from cans. Oh, but you can't call me homeless friends Cause I live in my van They've called it the van life I've heard this It's a fine life I've been sold this It's a fine line Between having to and choosing it Friends, let's roll up Let's blow this Well, the 7-Eleven's a sure belly ache. I subsist on a mere wake and bake Talladega to Chicago's Lake, sir, I'll take your largest case, so. And all the girls from Chickamauga to Passamacotti speak enviously in my big rustic body, and this old van might just be a Bugatti the way I get it from 60 to zero. Now I'm 60 miles of Fargo on a northern track, I'm burning rubber, it's no looking back. I'm pushing that thing like a maniac, I get tipped out like a stripper in singles and crack. Oh, I wish someone would fund them track. Instead of the van life, I've been told this. It's a fine life, I've been sold this. Now it's a fine line between having to and choosing it. Let's roll up, let's blow this. Well, the south of St. Louis can be a little gritty. It's a far cry from Seattle's tent cities. All in all, life's pretty pretty from the Starship Enterprise. Still a guy with a house and a big old lawn Thinks his block's too good for me to park on Bangs on my door with a letter that tells About a thousand ways he can make my life hell And he's worse than the guy who put a brick through my glass And robbed me blind and siphoned the gas Cause at least I know that guy needed it real bad And truly I wish that old boy well In the meantime a cop is banging on my door Telling me I can't park here anymore What do you do friends, what do you say You rev up the engine You rev up the you rev up the, it doesn't always turn over the first time. You, you rev up the engine and you drive away. Chalk it up to the van life. I've been told this. It's a fine life. I've been sold this. It's a fine line between having to and choosing it. Let's roll up. Let's blow this. Well, I pull into Charlotte to wet my whistle. They see my duds and they give a whistle. I say, sorry, girls, you got to pay for this gristle. You got money, I got time. And the spot on your floor is a goddamn palace. The mug of Budweiser's a goddamn chalice. I say to you, sir, without any malice, that your politics are bad. Tell your uncle his politics are bad. Now, friends, I figure this is as low as it gets. I'm blaming capitalists on the internet. My sweet old folks can't seem to forget my roughly 60K in medical debt. And while I'm out here trying to dumpster dive, there's a bunch of rich folks eating apple pie, and I'd rather die on this decent ride. Friends, won't you pickle my bones in cheap red wine? Just pour it out on the ground and say that I was a pretty good time. Probably on account of the van life, I've been told this. 
It's a fine life, I've been sold this But it's a fine line between having to and choosing it Let's roll up, let's blow this Well, we crashed all the parties, drank cakes with the foam Nicky Bob's the best yoga I've ever known Now we're all so lonely and never alone And kissed a thousand times Saw the bombed out buildings of the lower ninth Those street walkers living on the edge of a knife Oh, trap, brass, music, man, it's the life If you never felt half alive Colorado behind me, blue sky above me New Mexico mountains are so damn lovely I tried not to love her, I just couldn't fight it New York is great, I just don't like it San Antonio on up to Maine Cheap motel rooms, awful cocaine It's not a crusade, it's not even a war It's just the feeling you've been inside this Waffle House before Well, I'll say one buck ninety is too much for gas I drive too slow, let anyone pass Someone asked if I'd dance with their daughter I said that I wouldn't even know she was awkward If I showed you my wallet, you'd laugh at me But I drank half the craft beers in Cincinnati Got offered fifty bucks to suck someone's dick But I done it for free, but I just don't turn tricks I say, girl, I say, damn, I've been trying to reach you For the cut of your jib and you talk about Nietzsche There's nobody like you in all fifty states Except for Arkansas, uh, Alaska, Oklahoma There's that one in Manitoba that one down there in Chihuahua, possibly one in California. But friends, I just chalked that up to the many years of the van life. I've been told this. It's a fine life. I've been sold this. It's a fine line between having to and choosing it. Let's roll up. Let's blow this. Well, it's a sexy kind of lifestyle for certain folks. Fractal highways, friends like smoke. It all goes up and you end up alone. It's like the internet is your real home. Put that one in your pipe and smoke it. Mm. Oh, man. It's like we're all here in, in virtual reality on the internet together. Wow. It's like the internet is our real home. How, where else do I live right now? Where else do we live? We're only inside boxes made of light. So every time I'm feeling down on my luck, friends, I think I might trade it in for a couple of bucks. I hear some guy like Elon Musk talk about how soon we're all going to have cyber trucks, and I think, God damn, life must be easy if you're one of these rich gentlemen. And I'm pretty sure that I prefer the van life. I've been told this. It's a fine life. I've been sold this. It's a fine line between having to and choosing it. Let's roll up, let's shake her down. Let's gussy up, let's throw it down. It's a fine line up a time you're behind. Get along fine, chug a luck, chug a luck, hidey ho. All my friends are not anachronisms and not compromised by alternative lifestyles. And American meritocracy is a lie, which is to say, let's blow this. That's right. The owls like it too. Dude. Thank you very much. Thank you to the owls for joining us. Uh, I believe that we have have Professor Dylan Earl up here next to regale you uh, with uh, a. Se- I'm just an associate adjunct down at the county. <laughs> <laughs> up here at the Madison County Institute of Technology, we take all faculty se- extremely seriously. <laughs> Mad Pope. Uh, come on up here, Dylan. We really do have owls. That's not even a prop. Well, I won't even bother with introducing this song, but I feel obliged to, I suppose, um, do do a bit of a traveling one. Good to be out here with Cousin Nick and Uncle Willie, Uncle Bill, excuse me. So, anyhow, this is a song that's also full of inside jokes and bullshit. And uh, speaking of the van life, which we have all been educated on. I feel like we're all professors now after that, that lesson. Anyhow, this one's for the boys that are always willing to hop in with me. The song's called Buddy. Buddy, won't you let me take you with me? I'm gonna give away all my memories. Backing them up tonight There's no need to leave them at home When I can put them in a song And we can play them all night long For drinkers in another town 
And early in the morning when we're back out on the highway Pushing back miles to listen to the gears shake We'll laugh We'll be lonesome We'll be tried It'll be hard living A little scary when it ain't fun Like bandits on the run from nothing And a Ford Econo line Keep honky-tonking We're gonna spin them around the floor Until they can't walk out the door And well, sometimes neither can we but early in the morning when we're back out on the highway Pushing back miles to listen to the gears shake We'll laugh We'll be lonesome We'll be tried You know there ain't no money in it But we'll have smiles on our faces Doing beers in our favorite places Between here and old Helltown That's along the Mississippi River in the Delta A place called Hell in Arkansas We'll keep our ears to the ground For a place to sleep each night But keep your bags packed And when we do the last show We're gonna drive the whole way home Cause early in the morning when we're back out on the highway Pushing back miles to listen to the gears shake We'll laugh We'll be lonesome We'll be tried You hear that? be doing most things our way living life the hard way gets easier the further you're from home good to be pretty far away from home but right at home with y'all okay cuz cheers good to see you boys I'd like to give it back to the the fellow himself thanks thank you can i try out that ledge there that was slick guitar playing yeah you need to do that <clears throat> I couldn't recommend that ledge enough. All right, so wait. We got this Arkansas-themed gathering here, to some extent, uh, in the place we are in, which is Arkansas. And we've kind of been, like, trading songs. So those were all new songs, right? Yeah? That's true. Okay, cool. Um, next round, let's try old songs. All right. All right? How old are we talking? Oh, I'm going to go Dump Truck Boys old. I was going to say, we have, we yeah. have to do some old, the, the anti-dilute so when I was younger, I, I mostly was in these bands that were just sort of uh, irreverent more than anything. And this is one I wrote about um, my experiences in Madison County, which is where we're in uh, growing up. And Madison County is kind of, they call it Booger County because you're likely to end up a ghost. And uh, Booger is an old Southern word for ghost. Think boogeyman, but like with an ER. And uh, so the, there's, there's sketchy folks out here who have hard, hard times and people get in positions where they have to make decisions about how they're, they're going to make their next meal work and how they're going to put gas in their truck. And uh, sometimes it involves blowing up your trailer on accident. So this song I wrote about <clears throat> the, uh, the back roads of Madison County. And uh, in particular, I had in mind this sheriff, uh, Ralph Baker, who once stalked these hills. Look him up on uh, yahoo.org. Anywho, <laughs> praise be to uh, yahoo.org. Anyway, I'm going to try to kind of pull this out of my, yeah, we'll, we'll figure it out. Well, if times are getting hard, as they very well may Listen up, boys, I got something to say If you're in a fix and you need to make a dollar Best set your trailer in the back of the holler 
Well, me and some friends studied up a plan. We'd get rich without working for the man. Suit of fed matches and an iodine pour. There's something cooking behind the trailer door. Oh, take me back. Oh, take me back. Oh, take me back to my Ozark Mountain home. Oh, take me back. Oh, take me back. Won't you take me back to my Ozark Mountain home? Um. Oh yeah. <clears throat> Here we go, it's been uh, about seven years since I wrote the song, maybe eight. Well, things were going great, they were finer than the hell. With just a dove stove top and a digital scale. Oh, getting folks hooked is a hard pill to swallow, but there's always a line to the back of my holler. Oh, might have gotten dumb, man, I might have gotten lazy. Maybe the speed, it finally drove the crazy. Sheriff got a warrant, cause I was being dumb then. And in they come, oh, take me back, oh, take me back, oh, take me back to my Ozark Mountain home. Oh, take me back, oh, take me back, oh, take me back to my Ozark Mountain home. Well, it didn't take long to break down this floor, the door, screen shelf fat. Oh my lord, this is, I knew this was gonna happen. Well, it didn't take long to break down the door, the screen shelf fell shattered on the trailer floor. Well, the cop yelled, boy, drop that gun, then bang, 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 and away I run. Oh, take me back, oh, take me back. Oh, take me back to my Ozark Mountain home. Take me back. Oh, take me back. Oh, take me back to my Ozark Mountain home. Well, they sent me downstate with the snakes and the flies With a flatland swamp, I'm bound to die But I'm gonna steal a car Gonna steal a gun, there ain't a John Law alive that can stop my fun. Oh, take me back, take me back, oh, take me back to my Ozark Mountain home. Remember when we used to be outlaws? Take me back, oh, take me back, oh, take me back to my Ozark Mountain. Sorry, Uncle Dave Macon, I know it's your really old Carolina home. <laughs> okay. Well, we dug that one out of my casket, so I appreciate y'all for being totally patient with that. It's thematic. Um, yeah, I wrote that song ages ago when I didn't really write songs. I couldn't play more than a G chord on the guitar. It's been a journey, so thanks for <laughs> sticking with me on that one. Uh, old songs, I challenge ye. I'm going to do the first the one I ever wrote. I'm going to see if I can remember it. I can fade, dude. Um, cause be, and it's because you did, it's because you took that risk of doing old material. And my first song, I should say first non-punk song, and I can't repeat any of the punk songs that I wrote for decent audiences. For yourself, decency. Well, I just feel like this capo's upside down even though it's not. It just <laughs> feels upside down. <laughs> Back when I first started to want to be a folk singer and not a punk singer. Um, erstwhile days I'm still fond of. I was living in Galesburg, Illinois, a little kind of lovely little podunk where the Maytag factory had just shut down. A little punk rock music, uh, punk rock music renaissance happened out there as a result of a bunch of young people being out of work. And um, I learned a lot from, from those uh, angry young guys about, um, about uh, how to live and some things about how not to live. So, um... Well, I see her buy lottery tickets with all the cash she has. Looks like she's gonna pass out on the floor. And what 
got some man to say but can i help you with your bags it looks like she don't want help anymore oh and dapper are the men dressed in their sunday best oh blessed are the rust bins where the refuse collects oh blessed are those women that showed up anyway it's already raining on independence day it's already raining on independence day and all the sons and fathers that come home from the wars and look around their rust belt towns and see that their children and their wives have been waiting away their lives like they did in useless wars overseas Oh, and dapper are the men that dressed in their Sunday best. Blessed are the rust bins where the refuse might collect. Oh, blessed are those women that show up anyway. Not supposed to rain on Independence Day. It's not supposed to rain on Independence Day. And all the meth heads and crackheads and the drunks I love but are so sad when they fall down and pass out round my door. Well, I want some man to say it's the best I've ever had And sometimes I don't want it anymore Oh, and dapper are the men that Dress in their Sunday best Blessed are the rust bins Where the refuse collects Oh, blessed are the women they all skip work today It ain't supposed to rain on Independence Day Oh, it ain't supposed to rain on Independence Day It's funny to feel how that song ages after about 10, ten years I think I would take some of it back now, but I still, there's quite a bit of it that I would not take back. Um, so, I, I love all of you, is uh, I think the addendum that I want to add to, to that experiment. Uh, <laughs> Mr. Dylan Earl, all right. here with the Git Fiddle. Well, I'm kind of torn between two, I suppose, but. Do y'all want to hear country or western? Both if possible. Well, shit, man. I can just easily do one at one time. I'm not really good at juggling. Singing about Johnny, Alabama. Let's think about one, one more time, maybe. I don't know. I think one more time would be lovely. You know what? This is going to be for Willie. It's so hard to pick songs, but I think I made the right decision. I think he did. This is a... Uh, I don't know, this is an older one for me, I suppose. Not really much to it, you'll hear though. There's a trace. to feel about you in the place I wound up today and I went 
It nearly swept me from my feet I was high enough to make my way downtown Tell clothes in time. You bathe with me under neon lights. You take to me just one more time. Well, I can see it in the way. My feet shuffle across the ground to the bar stools with none of my friends around. And the pace and the weight at which you cross my mind, well, it leaves me with nowhere else to find. You hang with me till close in time you Bathe with me under neon lights You take to me just one more time Well, I can see You can't leave Well, thank you kindly. Willie, I just, uh, I hope that we can get back to normal of our touring ways together. And, and Cousin Nick, you better get in the truck next time, Bubba. Buddy boy. Nobody's got a flat pick on their person. Do, do you want a thickie or a thinny? Uh, shit, dude, let's try with the thinny. Thickie or thinny? Yeah, I'm, I'm What, how thin, thin are we talking? Not He's there for you, thick or no, thin. No, yeah, that's, see, that's the thing. You know? We were talking about me not really being a guitarist. I wasn't really kidding. Like, when I was 27, I learned how to play my uh, first chord that wasn't a G, and I'm 31 now, it started to give it away, but I really suck at guitar, and so this is, you know, this feels intimidatingly thick to me, but. If I had a nickel. Uh, oh, oh, Lord, did the capo run off on us? No, it didn't. Well, I, I suppose, um, you know, you don't have to go home, but. Neither do we, because we are home, uh, but you can't stay here. We're, we're winding down, aren't we, friendos, here? I guess we, I one, guess we are. One more round here. So uh, thematically, so so I wanted to give you all a choice, because I'm really all about this, like, kind of uh, this this egalitarian ideal where we all get to, to pick and choose here. So what, what, what do we think? If we did, like, our favorite cover or our favorite song of ours, you know what I mean? Like, because you don't get to say what's your favorite song that you have written. I think... I think I mean I'm for favorite cover because mm -hmm. I, I I would I'm for favorite cover because I don't think I could do I don't think I could do favorite song. Right, it's kind of hard to say that too. Yeah. That's like mothers aren't supposed to pick a favorite son, right? Yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah. Or daughter or whoever, and that's that's how I feel right now. Um, okay, well I'm gonna, I might screw this up. No, I don't think I will. Maybe not. Uh, okay, so this is uh, a. <laughs> Swing, this baby. <laughs> swing for the fences. Um, so uh, this goes out to the whole of my uh, uh, New Orleans community. I love my little uh, Arkansas pod we got up here, but Chris Acker sings this one, and uh, I miss playing it on the streets and other places. And we've been talking about the road, and I know that's not just like sort of our musician nostalgia. I'm sure y'all appreciate things about being and traveling and having normal life, but I miss seeing... Uh, Y'all, I miss I miss the whole having each other thing, and this is one that uh, the the company that you keep out there uh, is is the best there is, and so this this one goes out to my buddies that uh, that sing this song. And this is a Roger Miller song. It's called "A World So Full of Love," 
And uh, I think somebody else covered it on the internet recently and made it a little more famouser. But I, I love the Rogers version. I think this might be the key we played in. We'll see. Oh, how does this one start? Hold on. <laughs> Don't you love it? This is it's sort of like... The first word. It's always the first word. Wow, it's remarkable. There was an uh, episode of, uh, what's it called? Revisionist History. Yeah, called Parapraxis. It's about this. Wow. This is, okay, this is going to bug the hell out of me. And this is supposed to be the theme. We're on, this is for all the world to witness my failing. Um, or at least whoever is in the corner there laughing right now. Uh, <laughs> my brother, I do not envy your son right now because it is, it is, uh, it is ah, I think everybody out there's got it. Everybody out there is remembering mm -hmm. where they put a treasured object right now. I could sit there there's about a thousand long. retainers about to get found. A thousand retainers. Oh shucks, this is embarrassing. Maybe I should go for my second favorite cover then. <laughs> oh poop. Um. Oh yeah, here we go. I know how it feels to be alive with no desire to live. I know how it feels to die inside and try hard to forget. And my way of finding out was cause a love had led me down. In a world so full of love, yet not enough to go around. I was once so proud to have her love that I could burst with pride. Then my sunshine turned to storm, and now it's all I feel it. It's enough to make me wish that I could hide and not be found in a world so full of love, yet not enough to go around. I could sit for days and wonder and not find the answer still by the time i die i wonder if by then i even will i could live to be a hundred if i hope to live it down in a world so full of love not enough to go around Yes, a world so full of love Yet not enough Flint, I've got enough love for you, my weird little alien dog. What's up, baby girl? Man, cuz, would you mind, cause. Would you mind displaying for perhaps for all of our... our, our the, the greatest audience we could have asked for on Instagram.com or otherwise, um, your your ability to to hoot back at this owl. We're hearing this owl. Oh shoot! Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. and I think that's, that's, that's great. Bring him. Bring him out. I say so. This is a barred owl, eastern barred owl, for all I know. But uh, yeah, I'll I'll give it a go. Made the guitar ring. I just bought this guitar, and to hear it sort of sing back to me after doing an owl call is a rare experience. You think, you think he's going to come? I started an owl orgy of sorts. I don't want to brag. I don't want to. I'm not the Caesar Milan of, of owls or anything, but they they really are at it. Well, I, I can't. I'm not going to hog up this thing. Uh, Billy, I think it's. I was about, we were about to get hot owl orgy action. Yeah, you just, you, you just I mean, like left us right I think there. That right now, you're being a tease to the owls and yeah. people out there. Give well, okay, them, one, one, one more out, one, one more. I think they think I'm just diseased. 
That was a sexier oh, one. That was a little I better, huh? That being a little more. You gotta stand. You need some diaphragm. It's like singing. You need just a little more altitude there, guy. Uh, <laughs> could I, could I bump that JB Pickerton? I put it uh, right next to the candle. I just meant to tell you. Pickerton. I didn't uh, know old JB was coming out tonight. Um, Daryl, would you would you pass me the the Echo French harp uh, um, there on the on right the on holder? On the what now? Uh, the the harmonica. <laughs> oh, on the here we go. The, 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 now, the, the tremolo uh, mouth organ. Aha. Uh, we'll, be used the, we'll be using the tremolo mouth organ for the owl orgy to come. Um, <coughs> the stoke some that. fire so he can uh, speak in a stoke. Well, uh, yeah, my favorite cover is a little known, um, but uh, that's just because it's a great, great old folk song. That's close enough for Jesus. Um, uh, this is a song by the great uh, anarchist folk singer, U. Utah Phillips. I think, uh, Nick, you spent some time out on in one of the, the, the boxcars that he lived in, right? I, I, was, I was down the... So I was in Red's caboose, but Utah Phillips' caboose was across the way. Uh, the guy who's working on Utah's caboose is in Fayetteville right now. Right. Oh, really? Yeah. I think we I, have, we I, should, I well, to tell you that. It's too bad. <laughs> well, maybe we'll get to go see it. Uh, well, Utah Phillips is a great anarchist folk singer and philosopher and uh, rumored to be an Egyptologist as well. And um, he wrote a, a whole bevy of, of great American folk songs that um, he didn't bother to let Johnny Cash cover, which is a, a move that I, uh, I, I, I respect because of how much integrity he had and what great politics he had. I think that country music needs more squeaky clean um, heroes um, uh, uh, like uh, Utah Phillips. And... Um, I used to, this has been my favorite song for a long time, um, and uh, it's called She'll Never Be Mine. I used to think that this song was about the indefatigability of the American spirit, uh, you know, people always wanting more and more urge, or ever the procreant urge of the world, like, we're never satisfied, we're American, we're going to be better, she'll never be mine, she'll never be mine, but uh, then to hear Utah Phillips explain it on a record I heard of his after he passed away in 2007. Um, he said it was about how in the American West, the people that broke the West, the people that built the railroads, that logged the trees, uh, that mined the gold, um, they never saw a cent of it. She'll never be mine. She'll never be mine. My love is a river where the white waters pour I hunted and trapped her by the gates of Lodore She sings with the spirit of a cool mountain rain Where I won her bright silver in a high cord lane She'll never be mine She'll never be mine Though I won all her treasures so simple and fine I know she'll never be mine My love's a cantina where I drink with my friends I called her Dolores and sometimes Cheyenne I followed her begging all over the west My love is a headlight on the midnight express She'll never be mine She'll never be mine Though I want all her treasures so simple and fine I know she'll never be mine My love is Montana and the high Douglas fir Oh, in many long summers I labored for her She sings with the spirit of the high autumn corn she came from the land where my children were born She'll never be mine She'll never be mine Though I want all her treasures so simple and fine I know she'll never be mine This says the rest of it My love is the life that a boomer will lead You chain her with lies, you trap her with greed. 
My love is a dreamer. I follow the dream. You say she's a beggar, but I say she's a queen. Someday she'll be mine. Someday she'll be mine. For I've won all her treasure, so simple and fine. I know someday she'll be mine. I know someday she'll be mine. Well, thank you very much, friends. Um, thank you. Uh, we haven't said thank you yet to our hosts here. Uh, you're on the Western as Fuck channel. Don't forget it. Stay Western in your own way. Um, this is, uh, uh, I guess this will be Mr. Dylan Earl up here suppose, right next. I guess I'll tell the numbers crunch. I'm no, I'm no fucking rotation doctor here or nothing, but I'm not going to talk your ear off about it either. Um, I don't know. I got a lot of songs I really like to cover, but. Um, and I guess I'll follow along with the theme of using this J.B. Pickerton as well, I suppose. Very grateful to be on the World Wide Web with you tonight. Live, in person, in color, and living Arkansas color from the Ozarks here. And uh, piping in through the Western Ass Fuck channel. Thank you guys for having me along. It's an honor to be here. Um, so I guess maybe rounding us all the way back to trucking themes and moving things and just being willing to go the extra mile for your pals and loved ones out there, um, especially uh, all your road buddies. You know, we all we all traverse uh, pretty similar routes and separate routes and perpendicular and parallel routes and all sorts of kind of different up and down ways around each other and you know with each other and slithering just by each other. You know, so this song's for for all y'all out there and I hope that we get to truck along to the days in the not too distant future in which we get to slither and wiggle all around each other again. Anyhow, this is a Little Feet song that I really love the way Linda Ronset does it. It's also the greatest daggum trucking song I've ever heard. I've been warped by the rain, driven by the snow, I'm drunk and dirty. Don't you know that I'm still I'm still willing Out on the road late last night I see my pretty Alice in every headlight Alice My sweet Ozark Alice And I've been from Tucson to Tucumcari To hatch a beat of town to Paul I've driven every kind of rig that's ever been made Taking the back road so I wouldn't get away And if you give me Weed, white sand, wine And you show me a sign I'd be willing to be moving Smuggled some smokes and folks from Mexico Sun burns my skin every time I go to Mexico but I'm still Hit by the hail Stung by the sleet Had my head stove in But I'm still on my feet I'm still I'm still willing And I've been from Tucson To Tucum Carry To Atchafi to Town Upon Driven every kind of rig That's ever been made Taking back roads I wouldn't get away And if you give me Weed, white, sand, wine 
Can you show me the sign? Well, I'd be willing to be moving. A little more well than I was hoping to do, but all right. Well, that's about as, as good as I couldn't have done it because I didn't do it. And, but um, and yet there it was. Well, I just love that song. I think it's fantastic. And I love hearing y'all's songs. It's been, it's been so nice to rub up against your sound waves at least. Hey, you know? we can pretend normal, and that's as good as it's going to get for now. I'm glad that we all did something new today. At risk of being cheesy, you know, I think yeah. everybody should. You ought to try something new if you're if you're feeling by yourself. Do something silly, uh, which is to say, try something, try try singing your heart out or something you don't necessarily know perfectly yet. Well, we're getting word from the top <coughs> and that theme that we should uh -uh. Uh -uh. maybe try to ad hoc some 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 trio thing as we sign out tonight. Wow. And so so maybe because you and I trade real quick and we'll. I think I, I know just the call, call and response that yeah, we could get JD done. J.D. Pickerton in, as well? Done in one verse. J.D. Pickerton it is. Okay, folks. This has been the cabin fever. I hope your fever is only in your cabin and not literal. Um, as we're, uh, we're all negative, but uh, by God, we're trying to keep a positive attitude out here on the mountain. We're here in Booger County, Arkansas. My name's Nick. My last name's Shoulders. That's Willie Carlisle. That's my cousin, Dylan Earl. Uh, by God, we're uh, we're having as much fun as uh, y'all are, I sure hope. But uh, yeah, we're gonna do a little call and response on the way out. Uh, Want to thank Western AF and Jim's on VHS for having us on this cabin fever uh, session, and uh, the session is expiring. So. that gal and I always will Arkansas. Oh, her liver, lips and her hair so black She was so cross-eyed, that's a fact She died and the tears rolled down her back Down in the Arkansas Down in the Arkansas Down in the Arkansas Down in the Arkansas Hope you guys are having a great night. We sure did. Uh, we'll catch you later, by God. The Internet's cool, and so are you. Say no to fascism. Have a good evening. Booyah.